Uh, the reason why I decided to do Miss Black America um, is because one, the history of Miss Black America, um, it has an amazing, strong history for our community. Um, number two, I feel like um, a lot of our community don't know about the Miss Black America pageant and why it's so important um, to our past and how it can affect and just better our future. And for three, I feel like I need to contribute and do my part and do my doing uh, for this pageant for this platform and for my community as well. So career-wise, I just wanna be a very diverse um, businesswoman, entrepreneur. Um, right now, I'm currently helping my family with our mobile food business. And I am also um, currently um, building my own e-commerce clothing store. Um, so that's just the beginning of I, what I feel like is going to be an amazing um, career in entrepreneurship and business and overall com um, communications. <laughs> pageant, um, just the way it was created, the Miss America pageant, the actual pageant for our country, um, at one point they didn't allow black contestants on the stage to even enter it. And that was the infamous uh, rule number seven. Um, and it was placed in the 1930s. It did get revoked in the 1950s. However, there still wasn't a, a national state winner on the actual stage, um, even in 1968. And so that is what actually created and birthed a Miss Black America. And that's how Mr. J. Morris Anderson created this platform for us. Talking about Emily's Black Girl Magic, uh, for one, um, I love, love, love to just be a part of the community, be a part of people. Um, so that's kind of what started my entrepreneurship, connecting with people, connecting with others, explaining to others why a certain product could be so important or why a certain business is so important or why you should support that particular business. Um, that is a passion of mine. Fashion, I'm a huge fashion lover. Um, I truly enjoy it um, and just representing that actual um, fashion side and my culture um, to the world. People can help me get to Philly by um, donating or you can actually do a sponsorship. I do have um, sponsorship available still, still accepting sponsors. Many of my sponsors currently are local business owners, which is what my platform is all about. And with my sponsors, you're not just supporting me, I'm also in a way supporting you because I'm representing your brand, representing who you are. And I want to make this platform not just about me, but about my sponsors as well. So when you invest in this journey of me going to Philadelphia, um, it's also you investing in your community, in your state, because I'm also representing my community, representing my state. <laughs> Family is so important to me um, because for one, the support, um, having someone there supporting you, letting you know you're not by yourself uh, is so important. And if I can show that importance to other people that my family showed me on why support is so important, I feel like, you know, our community can grow um, with, you know, in our economy and just grow overall when it comes to information. Um, so that support, I think, for one, is why I'm so family oriented. Um, number two is the love. Um, loving through thick and thin, you know, family can love you through it all. Family will love you through your mistakes through your growth, you know, and if I can show friends that, I'm showing friends the, the love I get from family and they reciprocate that back to me, why can't I show that to my community?